wrong right now But there's a resentment Tomorrow my eyes can It's all I pay for Stand on my shirt No bitch to my nerves Old nigga got cut Going back on my word then Hi, I'm Susan You're watching Billboard <laughs> Yeah. I don't know, I always think of the most dramatic skirt. Like when I hear a skirt, I'm like, no, really, I'm gone. I actually don't argue. I don't wanna argue. Like, I just rather not talk to you. So it's like, if we go off and really go there to the point where I'm talking crazy, it's like, we're probably neither gonna talk to each other again by the time I'm done. Wait, you, do you drink? No, but you know I smoke and I drink. Oh, okay. See, I don't smoke, but I drink. I don't drink because I, I be crying and shit. And then... <laughs> Love to my ladies. I've dated a few. I did. I did say that. I said that. It's true. Like, my feelings, like, I'm just moody as hell, so... <laughs> it's all a reflection of my moody moods, so... I don't know, like when I'm not, like after therapy, I probably won't be able to like make music anymore or really? something like that. Yeah, so I'm gonna probably start therapy like after this next one. <laughs> Last text message I sent, I'm drunk at MTV right now, wilding. Ha <laughs> ha. Love, love, love. As long as we got love, 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 as long as we got. I guess I just kind of started being my own therapist. Like I wanted therapy really bad and I just couldn't get any, so I just wrote an album. Muppets vacation, like Kokomo. That's where we wanna go. And I always get excited when I, like when I hear tropical beats. Like I just think of that whole like Bermuda. Bah, I don't know. I need. I need I'm done. I was in the studio with Mark Ronson and Kevin from Tim and Paula, and I was doing all of his harmonies and like little runs, just singing like his little bridge parts. Yes, to to this other song, and then. Yeah, he was so nice about it. Thank you, Kevin. He was so sweet. <laughs> I guess this is serious McGee. But my shirt is full of whimsy, and I think that is more important. Yay, bye, me. My forehead is massive. Okay, bye. Because <laughs> of me and my mouth. Why are you bothering me? You literally don't want to do anything but smash. So we all know that this is not happening today. So why don't we just reconvene for like never? Some artists can be comfortable anywhere because they're very like cerebral. I'm a visual person. I'm very reactive to my environment. It's wood and stone and in the middle of the woods also. And just perfect. It was like the ingredients for stuff to happen. And we also made chicken. And that was nice. He took us through like a genuine artistry process and then he, um, laid like the simplest whispers. He was like, I'm not even saying anything. Like I could say something if you want. I'm just like, oh, I love it. It's perfect. You're for real. <laughs> Early, if I'm writing for you mm -hmm. and I'm like, damn, what would you think about like based on what I know of you? I don't think that would be authentic because I don't know you. I could only write from my most honest point of view to see if you connect to it. I could talk to you, mm -hmm. then write about how what you said makes me feel like if I were you, like if I were me after me. listening to you. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> no, I don't regret any relationships. 
That's not true. Oh my God, I could have lived without at least like, I don't even know. Regretting a dude, like it's just a mess. I have to pretend you didn't exist ever now because you, you took it so far. Like you hurt my feelings, I'm embarrassed, you're wildin'. Now you have to just disappear out of my life. Me? Yeah. I'm telling y'all, it was dry and a bitter moment. <laughs> what did you have? Um, it was dark. <laughs> yeah, it was just sad. Mm -hmm. Um, it happened so quickly. I'm so glad. <laughs> Friend, I haven't dri driven the boat. Oh. It was dry and I choked. Ooh. Wait, give me a second. Give me a second. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. Wow, what a All time. Right. Damn. Oh, I'm good. I like clenched my butt and my stomach. <laughs> yeah. I've always loved like the Paddington Bear aesthetic. I think it's super childlike, but the colors, it's such like a pure yellow. It's always like, like a happy yellow. Going to get my chicken sandwich and I just wanted to say thank you and I love you very much and good days. Have a good night. Don't leave. Bye. I have to. I thought you were going to get your sandwich. I can come back and eat my chicken yeah. sandwich on live. And I'll bring my blunt and maybe we'll have some more talks. There we go. Give me like 10 minutes. I love you. I remember my sister and like went all the way to go visit some nigga and he just did not show up like at all in a whole nother state. That's never happened to me before. However, if it did, like I would have to murk somebody. That's the thing that like is just out of control. I'm just thankful, honestly, that like God made my words good enough to like reach other people and connect and like grow on their own. This is like my 11th birthday party and I received like a Bath and Body Works set and I was really, really hyped because I felt like, you know, cool girls smell nice. And like my sister really smelled nice all the time and I wanted to attempt to join her. But I don't know, it's just like a grown ass gift for a little girl, like what? Why'd you buy me shower gel as a child? But either way, I'm grateful that I'm clean and this was free. Probably like 20 minutes ago, I sang another song off my album for the first time with no rehearsal in front of people on camera for the first time. And that was interesting. Love Galore is like a relaxed tropical bop. <laughs> and then with this album, I think somehow I just got like caught up. Last movie I cried watching was Captain Phillips, random. When they rescued him, it was just like, wow, I'm sad, but glad that you're rescued. But why does this happen to you?